Hi everybody, welcome to our digital kennel, GermanShepherdMan.com, and this video is a flea and tick update. We're going to talk a little bit about flea and ticks. I mean, it's June, and this is flea and tick season. Come, Whoopi. That's a good girl. Come, Whoopi. Hey, Rachel. Good girl, Rachel. Come, Star. Star. Come. Good girl. Okay. Now, fleas and ticks. <sighs> wow. Fleas, back in the 90s, I was just learning about breeding German Shepherds, and boy, I, I, I did not pay attention to fleas. And I had a flea infestation, and it was a hard, hard thing to go through to, to get all them killed off, beat back, and that's when my, whoa, I got to learn how to defeat fleas process began. And uh, I use, come baby. I use NexGuard. No, they don't pay me anything to say that. There are a lot of different uh, flea tick medications out there. I use HeartGuard for worms and NexGuard for fleas and ticks. And basically, it stops the life cycle. Now, uh, if a flea does come on this property, and it happens. I mean, I live in a forest. Raccoons live around here. Possums live around here. Squirrels. And occasionally, a really brave squirrel will actually come through the fence and, and play around out here, dig and hide nuts and so forth. <laughs> and they, th these animals can have fleas on them. So those fleas or flea eggs or whatever can get off into the property. And this particular medication that I use, if a flea does find my dog, bites my dog, uh, that's the end of that particular flea's life cycle. So that's why I use it. I've had no ill effects. I've been using it for years, and uh, they look great, as you can tell, and they feel great. Now, ticks, off in the distance, outside my fence, you can see kind of the forested area. Can you see that good, Jay, back there? You see how there are a lot of, during the, the growth times of year, during late spring and summer, there's the, everything just grows and becomes green and, and flowers and stuff. I mean, that in the winter time looks barren. There's nothing green. You could see the floor of the forest all the way as far as you could see. And that's the time of year in the cold winter time when all the vegetation's just, uh, the frost has killed it back. See, these ticks <clears throat> like to live on these, these, these bushes. And if I were to take my dogs out into that right now, they're going to pick up some ticks. So one way, flea and tick medication, I do that. But another way is avoid that type scenario with your dog. I know a lot of people all over the world like to take their dogs on walks, especially through forested type walks and so forth. But hey, you're risking a tick getting on your dog or multiple ticks if you walk through that type of vegetation. So a way to alleviate that is to only go during uh, really cold parts of the year. That's what we do here. And again, I just try to transfer to you guys information that I learned from you guys and from my experience so that you can learn from all of us together as a family. Speaking of learning as a family, if you just got a German Shepherd puppy, you're gonna be getting one, get my puppy training system. It will have you confident. It's all the little things in one course parked online so you can go to it and learn forever. And once you've learned my puppy training system, you'll have it not just for this puppy, but 10 years from now, when you get another puppy, you'll have my system in your brain. <laughs> It'll help you a lot, give you a lot of confidence. Thank you for that. Matter of fact, thank all of you from all of us. Wh where'd everybody go? GermanShepherdMan.com. <laughs>